Okay, I came back here with Jordan Williams, a uh, 5'11 junior for North Kitsap Vikings. Well, it's just being much heralded in game, Jordan. As uh, you know, uh, you get to be recognized by 26 in North Kitsap. Packed house here tonight. Everybody thought that perhaps this might be a little closer contest, but it wasn't tonight. And partially due to you in the first uh, half action, getting the uh, the scoring going for the North Kitsap Vikings. Quick eight points for you, and that helps set the tone for the rest of the way out. Uh, yeah, yeah. The tone. yeah. Uh, is they, they, you know, they were, obviously they had Kate Ornass, obviously they had Harry Davies. So they feel in, you feel it nicely scoring wise. Yeah, you know, I just try to, you know, contribute as much as I can. Like, those two guys are going to get there every single night. I just try to contribute. Like, if they need me to fill up the stat sheet, I'll fill it up. If they need me to just play defense, I'll play defense. You know, I just contribute. I just want to get the win. So it's all about that, you know. You know, uh, what did you talk about in the pregame coming over here, maybe on the bus, maybe to his other teammates, and maybe in the locker room before this game? Uh, pregame, you know, we saw him at home before. You know, it, I mean, it was it was close going into the half, but, you know, we ended up finishing it with a, a, a bigger margin of the score, you know, but we still came in here, different environment, different atmosphere, different people, you know, different different hoops. Uh, we just treated it like it was another big game. You know, we didn't we didn't just because we beat them last time doesn't mean we're going to run them again. Like it, it could always be different. So we just came in with that same mentality, like just come in hard and play our game. I mentioned the broadcast and I go, you know, you guys beat them at 26 at North Kitsap. I didn't for the life of me believe that you would dust these guys by 40 here. Yeah, no, I mean it's a great feeling. You know, we all we all went, came in hard, same mentality. You know, people came off the bench, kept the same effort, same intensity. So we came here, we got it done. So. What does it mean uh, for you and, of course, for the rest of your, your teammates to be uh, ranked number one? You know, it, it's, it's a blessing, really. We work really hard for it every day at practice, every game. You know, it's, it, it truly is a blessing, but we don't let it get to our head. You know, we just keep going. Hey, uh, I know we gotta, we get still more basketball to go get to finish this regular season, and then we have to go through the, the postseason tournaments, which I know you guys know that uh, you, you probably will go deep in. But, hey, you know, for you, Jordan Williams, with us. You're the future of this team for next year, man. Yeah, I know. I'm excited. You know, it'll suck to lose um, some of our guys, Cade, Harry, Mason. Uh, they're big, big, uh, big, big guys on the team, you know. But coming into next year, we got a few more people coming up. People will step up, you know, and we'll grow as a team. So I'm excited for it. All right. And uh, hey, what does it mean for you just to overall to get a victory here tonight on the road? It's great. You know, we keep it rolling. We keep the win streak pushing, you know. One game after another, you know, it's just same thing. Yeah, you know what? <laughs> yeah, we're talking to win streak. 19 straight games over Bermonton. Ouch, man, huh? Yeah, I know. That's crazy. That's wacky stuff. Well, Jordan Williams with it. Hey, nice win tonight, man, and uh, and uh, we'll see you down the road. I right, appreciate it. Hey, Jordan Williams here on the post-game interview, man. He, he chipped in uh, totally tonight. He had 11, uh, 13 points unofficially for Jordan Williams tonight. Had a great game, as the rest of his teammates. That'll do it from here. From Leslie Thor, Jim McKinnell's gorgeous post-game interview has been brought to you by... Bremerton 76 at the corner of Waddell Road and Wheaton Way in East Bremerton, home of the on-the-go biscuits and gravy.